What's up, guys? Today, we're going to be taking you through the Square Golf launch monitor. We're going to be setting it up, going to the software and everything else. So let's get started. All right, so to start off, we need to go to the website for Square Golf. So the website squaregolf.co.uk backslash. So once you're on the homepage here, you just go to download software for Square Golf. Depending on what kind of computer you have, it'll be different options. So today we're gonna do it with Windows because we have a PC. So all you do is click that and then it starts to download. All right, once we have that file downloaded, we're just gonna go ahead and open it. All users. Yes, we want to allow this app. And then go through the regular software. Yes, install. I'll take a second to install here. All right, it looks like we have it all finished and it will pop up. All right, so once we're here, you have to create an account. So we will go ahead and walk through that as well. All right, then you'll just get an authentication email sent to you and then you'll be able to log in. All right, and then once you have your account, continue. And then it's gonna search, you just connect your device there. All right, whenever you first log in also, you'll be able to put in your credits. So there's a card that comes in with your box. It's green on one side and gray on the other with welcome credits for a thousand. You'll go up here to the square where it has a zero, credits owned, register, and then you'll be able to type in your coupon code and that will give you 1000 credits. So we have driving ranges. You can change either the Highland or the Bayport. So we'll change it to Bayport, we're tracking. Fixed, tracking, we'll keep it at tracking. Total spin or backspin, let's go backspin. Let's go back and make sure that we have this in, let's do miles per hour and then it's in meter, so let's make it yard. And then feet for the green. All right, in case you need to change anything, if you wanna keep it meter, go for it and then you'll just be ready to go here. So once you have your ball in front of your launch monitor, it will show up in the left-hand corner there, um, and then the ball will also show up on the T. If you don't have your clubs with you, or if you just wanna have a quick hitting session, you can use the Square Golf Swing Stick. This swing stick lets you practice and analyze your swing anywhere. You can check key metrics in real time and use them to get better at golf. It's super convenient for quick practice sessions at home or on the go. In order to turn on your swing stick, you go to settings, turn it on. All right, let's go hit some balls. In the driving ranges, we have it at Bayport, tracking and backspin and side spin. All right, once the ball is ready, it should just be on the tee. So once we have the ball in play and the swing stick, yep, swing stick is available here. Okay, and then you just go for it. All right. I'll take a 192 drive. And there we have it. All right, thanks for going through the setup of the Square Golf Launch Monitor with us. If you have any other questions for anything, you can go to shopindoorgolf.com. We have experts there ready to help you out. Thanks so much.